Hey guys, Tech Show with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to connect your AirPods or the AirPods Pro to your iPhone 14 or any of the new iPhone on iOS 16. In this video, we're going to show you how easy it is to connect and also go through some steps to troubleshoot if you're having issues connecting your AirPods with your new iPhone. So let's dive right into it. First thing first is first thing, make sure that your AirPods are charged. Sometimes if it's low on battery, it's not charged, it's not going to recognize the device because it is, of course, a low on power and of course your iPhone make sure it has charged and powered up just like this and then the next thing you want to check is that your Bluetooth is turned on so from the top here we're gonna pull down the control center and make sure that blue icon is turned on to so turn it on you'll see if it's grayed out that's turned off you know make sure it's blue like that so it's enabled and turned on and if you can't connect to, to Wi-Fi it usually works best in case the AirPods need to update their firm as once they're connected they usually update it through the phone's network so you want to go ahead and settings as well you can also check out that your Bluetooth is on right over here as well and once you're ready to go with all that now we can start the connection so to connect it is simple as simply opening up the lid so once you open up the lid give it a moment you should see this pop-up menu come up now let's cancel this and try one more time and let's say if it's not coming up close the lid again wait about 15 seconds or so for it to do it and sometimes what you want to do is if it's still not connecting turn on or clock the screen and then unlock your phone one more time just to calibrate the phone to pick up new connection and then you're going to go ahead open the lid one more time you should see that icon as well as you can see the light here that's uh, green then once you see that menu it's going to have that animation here we're going to want to hit connect once you hit connect you're going to go back turn your airpods around on the back and you'll see here there's a circular flush button you want to press and hold that button and once you press and hold that button you're going to keep on holding it until you see the animation up and then you see that connecting happening now keep on holding it and now we have connected our airpods and then the first thing you should see here it's going to be either something about media control or announce call and notification so you can choose to customize this and then or just simply it next doesn't matter what option you select and then you can kind of select what kind of notification you want if any if you want anything or just simply turn not now and then what will happen is you'll get to this animation basically saying AirPods Pro you got the charge and the case and we're gonna hit that done option and it might come up one more time again but it shouldn't if you want if it does come up just do the same thing again sometimes it doesn't do it the first time and as you can see here we got connected here this time as you can see here the initial time we connected this case charge is actually lower than what it picked up so that's fine so once you're done with it we can go ahead and check the airpods pro option here on ios 16 as you can see here it tells us some things about the airpods as well and all the information is here and it has another thing here but don't have to worry about that now let's say if you're having issues connecting what can you do the first thing you can do is of course like you said close the lid a couple times wait about uh, 15 to 20 seconds and then try again now if you're still having issues go ahead and uh, turn off your device here like the iPhone you want to go ahead and turn it off so on the iPhone 14 Pro you're going to press the volume up and the side button at the same time you're going to press and hold like this slide it up and then wait till it completely shuts down and then you're going to hold this big side button until it powers back on that's going to kind of help the phone recognize any new signal if it's still having issues you're going to do the same thing again one more time now let's go ahead and uh, figure out the next thing if you're still having issues connecting what you'll need to do is go ahead and check your phone software here and then go to who settings general software update and make sure you got the latest version update the reason why you need the latest version install and updated it, it's because let's say if your phone here doesn't have the firmware that it needs because the airpods pro firmware is connected through the blue due to the bluetooth of the iphone software you want to make sure you download and install again the latest version as well so that will help can update the firmware once it's connected as well now let's say if you're still having issues what more else can you do now you can do is a factory reset or reset of your airpods which you can be done by holding this side button here which we demonstrated in another video that's a longer video we'll leave a link to that in the description section as well so you can check it out 
Lastly, the other thing to note is if you have this AirPod connected to another device like your older iPhone or another or another kind of Apple device disconnected from there too. Sometimes if it's connected to that one, it's not going to pick up as a new one. You want to go ahead and disconnect or forget that device on uh, on that device, the AirPods. To do that, you go into settings of that device, go to general, or actually go to Bluetooth, and then you'll see here that a name connected here, something like this. Once it's connected here, as you can see this one, we got to open it up again just to connect it to show you what we mean. You want to click on that, and then once you click on that, click on that icon, you're going to go down at the bottom here. At the bottom here, you'll notice here this option to forget. So you're going to forget the device on your older device. Again, this is if you're having issues still connect. You're going to hit that and then forget, and that will kind of unpair the AirPods from an older device that may be preventing you to connect it to your iPhone, the new iPhone that you're looking to connect. And then once you do that, and then come back to your of course phone that you want to connect to you should see the animation pop up again just like that and the light turning green so hopefully this quick little video help you guys resolve and set up your airpods with your new iphone 14 and if so make sure that like and subscribe button thanks for watching guys see you guys next time